Hello, my people, I don't come with updates. Yesterday, there was a news making the round say FBI, CIA, uh, drug law enforcement agencies and other agencies no go release Bola Ahmed um, Tunubu documents. Again, they said they're going to re uh, release 500 at the end of this month for, you know, five months. They said Bola Ahmed don't win the matter for US. Then uh, Emilio Camp then rejoice. Today, now, um obidati tv they tell us something else they say nothing like that send a propaganda i won't want to listen to this news watch the video drop your comments what do you think at the end of this month me personally now to the end of this one now we'll go know who they talk to or who they like when i watch the video don't forget to like and follow this page and also um subscribe to the channel thank you when jubilation they come out from the apc uh camp all the people will be saying then they go through uh the social media handles platform tweets and all those you can see the news when they come out from everywhere say jubilation you go see headlines like jubilation tinubu has five has finally won in u.s court you go see this like the breaking tinubu has stopped fbi from releasing the document well we won't bring on the truth and waiting be the truth and the facts of that very matter now we won't bring come today all those things when i see said in the right now propaganda there is no way Tinubu's motion has stopped anything from happening. So we'll go bring that one, come. We'll go explain it. Give everything what we say if they go on there. That very motion never even heard. The, the judge never even hear that motion at all. We'll go bring that motion, come. We'll go bring also the response, heavy response, where they be doing the in and Greenspan react. Their reaction to Tinubu's motion. We'll go bring and come. And we'll even tell them the federal government agency, that is the United States agencies, the FBI, the DEA, the CIA, and the IRS, and all other people will be said, then they for that very place. All the things will be said, then they talk. We go bring and come because he they very, very distressful. Say people go they rejoice over nothing, over nothing. And with me to do all of these things for studio, I get Angel for studio, and it's Princess for studio. And our own UC Maxwell will join us very uh, soon. Good day, my women in Nigeria. Good day, my women in Nigeria. My lovely and intelligent to be there worldwide. <coughs> Welcome. Let your neighbor say hope day. Don't mind my <coughs> voice. I have Katan. Okay, Welcome. Let your neighbor say hope day. Welcome, my people. Whether Tinubu like it or not, he will be disqualified because he submitted fake certificate to the INEC. Welcome. Let's discuss. Yes, yeah, so hello, obedient and women in Nigerians. Now, welcome to Obidati Family Television. My people, this season of this pair will soon stop. It will soon be over. Very soon, we are going to forget all this mysterious part and everything that is happening. Surely, the battle is not going to be smooth. The road is not going to... The road will be rough, but surely we are going to win. And we'll share our stories of how we we'll overcome. Join us on lots more. We'll have to discuss this evening. Yo, yeah, so make gonna join us as we discuss these very particular issues, especially as it concerns uh, the issue of that very matter where the US, where they talk about. Everybody, one million Nigerians, what we say, then they, uh, for Nigeria and everywhere around the world, then they expect uh, to see that very particular uh, uh, files, criminal records of Tinubu coming out from the FBI. So, and um, all the jubilation where APC people they get and Baptist people they get, all those things that they are having is going to go through, uh, is going to go through uh, to all Nigerians for them to see. So as you can see in the screen, um, uh, the, you can see in the screen, breaking jubilation as U.S. Court gives fresh ruling on request to compel FBI, CIA, IRS to release documents on President Dinobu. Who and who are jubilating? Who and who are enticing? For you to know that, let's check out what Obayo Onanuga said on his tweet responding. As you see, this is today's um, date. So, you, uh, I want us to understand that the people who are jubilating are the people who are the direct beneficiaries of falsehood. Bio Onanoga. He said President Tunubu intervened his own case in Washington, D.C. That is one of the people. And when you go to the comments, you will see a lot of people who are giving false fabricated information. And those information are meant to deceive the general public that uh, that the matter in U.S. It has been nullified or sort of has been stopped. But that is not the case. So I want us to deep, go in there and explain it so that we go understand how these things take up and how it take day. Three things there for the table. One, the motion that was filed, that was had yesterday, 
by uh, by the district judge uh, Howell in Washington DC simply dwells on the emergency motion that was brought by our own Greenspan in collaboration with David Dundee. And it's simply to say, LBI already have like 30 days to deal with these things, but they, they have looked at the point where Supreme Court on one night, in one day, just said, oh, we are hearing this matter the next working day. They gave this very something on Friday, and they said, we are looking at hearing the motion, taking the appeals of the Supreme Court by Monday. This is just one day notice, working day notice. That came off a sudden. And that's why Aaron Greenspan, in collaboration with David Dunde, who has been pushing this matter for a while, decided to, you know, expedite the matter to, you know, to make it faster by requesting that uh, a motion. As a matter of fact, they said they can do it through call, through Zoom. It was just to say, hey, can we get this thing faster than the 30th or before the end of the month? Can we get this faster? And what did happen, this is the emergency uh, hearing to compel immediate document production. It's just to say, hey, can we get this very document faster? Already, MPI has assured the court in the previous sitting that they are going to give this very document on or before the 30th of October. And we have like five days, four days, uh, six days to go. So they are asking, can we get it because we have an emergency? Now the court sat yesterday and said, well, you know what? I have not seen any damage that is going to happen. But anyway, now we come back to studio because not only me there for studio. I get Angel and I get uh, this thing. And the amount don't they do many many things. So Angel, make we start from you. Make you for explain and give us uh, the your understanding of uh, what happened yesterday for court. Yes. Yeah, so the issue be say whether Tinubu like him. If him like make him write ten times, twenty times to court, FBI must release in document next week. That one a sure banker. If him like make him run from here, reach US with leg. They must release her. They say they must release her. If he claims saying they claim, so why is he stopping it? Why is he stopping it? If he claimed that he's clean? Yeah, um, uh, well, we'll get to that. Uh, Esther, she says since your mother do me me. Well, anyway, they seem to say, to not even get the power in the first place to go to, to counter or to motion, to file any motion for inter, uh, inter, inter, as an intervener. Because it's not an intervener in the case, number one. And he does not have any right. The FBI is claiming the right that uh, is under his privacy laws. The FBI knows the documents to release and they know the ones that are confidential. He was not to release. And secondly, he's a public, like he's a, he's a public citizen and not a private citizen. The moment he ran for the office of the presidency and even went as far as stealing the people's mandate. So he should expect anything he's seeing, he's seeing or in fact anything that ha is happening to him now, he actually bargained for it. So he doesn't have any right to fight for, the, for it. I know that the U.S. is not going to tweet arm. They are going to release that document at the appropriate line, as they have um, already said. Okay. And I'm coming back to you. If you uh, recall, the people who are jubilating are actually jubilating over nothing because what the court ruled on yesterday is not the motion by Tinubu at all. As a matter of fact, as at that very hearing of yesterday, Tinubu was not a party. What the judge did was acknowledge in the order that she gave that there was, that there is a motion of an intervener who is coming in, you understand me, which she has not attended to. It's written there on the document. So, the people who are jubilating are jubilating over nothing. They have been giving false information. Because they are ignorant. They have been misled. Exactly. Yeah. So, I just need our audience to understand that the judge was explicit in her order that Greenspan, who asked for this emergency, emergency. Uh, motion, that brought the emergency motion, by listening to him, he has not brought anything that compels emergency. There is nothing that shows that there is an emergency situation that requires that. And he, she also explained that uh, the FBI that is going to release this document have like people who are queued up to get things from FBI. Exactly. Like the documents are uh, are going to be, you know, for the yes. public, they are going to be, you understand me? They have so, they are scheduled, lined up. Exactly. So mm. it's more like, do not jump protocol. That you are not giving me a reason why FBI should do jump protocol. protocol. Exactly. And moreover, FBI said by the end of the month, which ends in, in another week. six days, as the case might be, six Next days, week. as the case might be. So what is the hurry? Why are you hurrying them? Why are you actually uh, telling them now to do an extra? To, fast, said, track. to fast track it. You understand? Yeah. They don't deem the action of the Supreme Court of Nigeria to be something that will warrant an immediate uh, distance. You understand? Yes. Because even if that matter was brought out um this thing it will only show um through social media and other platforms to the judges that hey this criminal record exists but coming to you um uh, esther as you know this very particular evidence we are talking about is not even as if the supreme court are not aware 
Okay. The Supreme Court has the desire, they already read. Yes. Come to think of it, the average person at Supreme Court is about 60 years to 65 yeah. years old. Exactly. You understand me? Exactly. So, this means that these people are privy to those things, or not privy as in that they joined with him or conspired. I mean, they, they knew. knew they knew they, are they cannot tell us that they are not aware that Dinubu had dealt drug. Yes. I mean, they will be deceiving it's themselves, not really uh, us. You it's understand me? Yes. yes. When the matter is not before them, we can understand that the facts may not be before them. Yes. But let them not find ignorance like they don't know the truth. They know the truth. Yes. Even that yesterday, uh, Justice Inyang is asking whether to collect the letter from the Chicago State University or to take the deposition. Mm -hmm. Is he a child? Yeah. He knows what to collect. Yes. He should not twist our hands. He should not fool the Nigerians because Nigerians are no longer ignorant now. Yes. It is no longer business as usual. And uh, that's why yesterday I was pointing out the fact that what he is talking about is inclined to what uh, the Chinubu and APCs are saying. If you recall, there's a time that Jackson Ude actually tweeted something like that they are going to go through the script and they are going to look on technicalities. It is more of looking at technicalities when, when you first of all start with asking which of the evidence exactly. are you going to take. First of all, a judge, a justice of the, of the Supreme Court, yes. Federal Republic of Nigeria, mm -hmm. should know the weight of the position against a document that is written by somebody a else that, letter. that is not even certified. Exactly. You understand? So that is one of the things. And again, one of the things he said that yesterday that really got me thinking. He's talking about that we must uh, look at it from the reasonable probability. That is a uh, uh, um, uh, reasonable cause of... Uh, how did he even uh, mention that? That is, he must have a uh, uh, reasonable damp beyond... Yes.